asylum and all comes full circle. Can't have a Batman game without finishing an Arkham Asylum, right? Everything good? Orderlies are rounded up. That's the last of it, then. Oh, yeah, boy. The children of Arkham have taken over. Lieutenant Gordon says the GCPD are on their way. He's leading the team himself. If you can find Alfred, maybe you can get him out of there before all hell breaks loose. Almost ready. Let her know. Copy. On our way. Go ahead. I got this. Alright, this guy's about to get fucking domed. It's time to play the game, this ends girl. Now, Vicky, tell me where Alfred Pennyworth is. The butler. Bruce Wayne has a bat on his payroll. Answer the question. Where he is doesn't matter. He'll be dead soon. Another corpse in Bruce Wayne's family. No one's dying tonight. You really think you're in control here? <laughs> Your confidence is impressive, but that won't save the butler, or the rest of Gotham. A lesson needs to be taught. They won't look the other way. Not again. And when did Gotham look away from you, Vicky? Don't try to psychoanalyze me, Batman. You have no idea what I've done to come this far. Too much to turn back now. I don't care what you've been through, how long you spent in that hole, how many times they beat you. The only thing I care about is locking you up. For good this time. <laughs> I see why you fight for the heartless people of the city. You're just like them. And you'll suffer the same fate. Your time's run out. Not today, punk boy. I don't know why I keep trying that. It never works. <laughs> There's nothing you can do, Batman. You underestimate the true children of Arkham. These souls kept behind bars. Open the doors! Please tell me Joker's gonna be here. I know most of these guys. I met them before. They're nice. To me. Freedom is yours. The only one standing in your way. Is Batman. Batman. He stuck me in here! Me too. Let me out him. He's the crazy one. Did I stick you in here? Not hard to believe. Oh, Batman bowling. <laughs> that was easy. Dummies. Batman refuses to lay a hand on him, too. about to get booted. I don't know how you teleport to this room unless you all just look the damn same, which apparently is what's going on here. <laughs> the fuck was that? That was a weird cutscene. Oh, that guy's getting messed up. Yeah, there's the guy again. He keeps teleporting to different rooms. Pretty impressive, I must say. There's the corrupt guy that you got paid away. off. I'm not saving his life. I don't have the opportunity to. Who do you save? I save her. She's the doctor. No, I'm going to save this guy. You're going to get light bulbed. Hope you enjoy that. Oh, I was hoping I'd actually put the light bulb on. That would be better. I don't really want to save you. I'm going to throw you into the fire. A little midnight snack for you. Looks like he's trying to kiss him. And for you, oh, of course, I gotta use the steel chair, right? Like, come on now. Smack him right in the spine with it. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. Uh, 
for you boys. Uh, he's a taser on him. It'd be even funnier. Use his own little weapon against him. And for Miss Vale. Table or well, I'll go light fixture. That'll work. Hit her right in the head. <laughs> yep. What a plan. Yeah. And midnight snack. <laughs> That's a powerful fucking kick, man. And a chair shot. The guy likes to teleport around the fucking hospital. That guy will never speak again. And the last thing to do. Drop this on her bitch ass. It fucks. Oh, look at her. Super skills. Probably not gonna work, Batman. Just thought. Wow, it did. It laid her out, too. It cracked her skull open. I'm your hair. <laughs> Take your time, sons. When did she shave her head? That's the plan. Fuck out here, Dawes. Oh, there goes your head. A little stigmata for you. You are going to die. Better watch out, that guy's crazy, man. <laughs> Oh, full Nelson. Oh. <laughs> Truly inspiring. Such a pleasure to see your work in person. Jesus. Well, watch how they got the forks and the spoons. They're coming for their just desserts. I thought it was Gordon's funny. Here. We'll round up the rest <laughs> of the inmates. You stop Lady Arkham. Oh, blue boy. There's no way out now. There's always another way here, Batman. All the people that Thomas Wayne condemned to this place unwillingly, they speak through the walls. Their ghosts walk. They know the way. Well, I can't help those people now, but I can help Alfred Pennyworth. Take me to him. My pleasure. Shit, Doug. Yeah, that's like a 50 foot drop. I don't know how I survived that. Just disappear. She go invisible. That's bullshit. She can. Vicky. <laughs> You're not well, Vicky. You need professional help. <laughs> Says the man dressed as a bat. <sighs> She seems kind of normal to me. <laughs> the butler has to die. Payment for Thomas Wayne's sins. He took away my family, so I'll take away his sons. If you really want to save the butler, bring me Bruce Wayne. I am Bruce Wayne. If anyone can find him, it's you. He's probably cowering behind a 12-inch thick <sighs> wall and a hundred bodyguards right now. Why should I trust you'll keep your word? Because my mask is off now, Batman. I won't lie. But you're you just doing so her. much for one old man. Because I love him. Oh boy, oh boy. Yeah, not today. That would have sucked. Vicky. Stop playing games. This isn't a game to me. You know, Batman, I really don't understand. Why are you fighting me? I've done great things for Gotham. 
Falcone and Hill deserved to die. If anything, I did you a favor. We're fighting the same fight, Batman. Can you see that? We want the same things. I won't argue. Falcone and Hill got what they deserved. <laughs> That's quite the turnabout, Batman. I don't think I believe you. You shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be defending him. You think Bruce Wayne is any better than his father? He hides behind his status and wealth. He's a coward, leaving other men to carry his burdens. Not again. Whoa! That would suck too. Uh, crushed head. Why are there so many freaking traps down here? <laughs> and like very old school traps too. Oh, there she is. Oh, girl. Let's I'm curious, Batman. I know why I wear the mask. It's who I am. Who I was always meant to be. What about you? I was always meant to be a bat. Do you wear the mask to hide? Or to become who you really are? I'm Bruce Wayne, girl. Are you the man? Or the mask? The mask is a symbol. Some fear it, but for others, it brings hope. When I first saw it, I found it inspiring. And once you're dead, I'm going to mount that mask on my wall. But first, I'll see the man beneath. I don't think you should do that, man. She's gonna blow the things out. She's gonna get squished to death. Yep. Look, you're fast. She's quick as sin, dude. No one cared about it, but... Okay, what is this? You know, spiritual in here? Hold on, Alfred. Uh, you... You... You came. You came for me. After what you said, I knew you'd come. The man, the man I, I made you. Just hold on, Alfred. Did you see where she went? Uh, she just dis disappeared. Yeah, I'm getting you out. she could teleport and shit. Above you! Oh, uh, no! <laughs> Interesting how you speak to him. So familiar, Alfred. <sighs> Such concern for someone you've never met before. Concern I don't have for you. Huh. Sounds like deflection to me. There's more here than you're telling. It makes me wonder, do you really care? Only one way to find out. Oh. That man, don't you? Shut up, old man. You've seen my true self. Your turn. I'll Prove show that mine you and show me yours. Take off your mask. Let me see the man you really. Oh, shit. Nah, fuck it. You know what? I'm a room cow. If that's what you <laughs> intend to see. No! Think I give a fuck, man? Let's do it. Must be some kind of trick. Bruce Wayne, he, he'd never be the man Batman is. Yeah, he would. He only looks out for himself. Oh, but of course. <laughs> now I understand. As Batman, you can prey upon the weak, the defenseless, just like your father did. A true Wayne. <laughs> that don't make no sense, There's girl. Nothing you crazy. Heroic about you. I can't change what happened in the past. I would have fought for you, Vicky. No one should have to suffer the way that you did. You don't know how I suffered. But you will. I'll show you what Thomas Wayne did to me. To my family. Oh, my ears, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> Funky 
shit right there. Oh, I all Mike Tyson, man, taking off my ears. No more lies. No more talk. The only truth left is in your death. It's a good thing I got this rock, man. I'll go fucking David vs. Goliath on you. <laughs> Take a leg. Sweep the leg, Johnny. Let's go, girl. I'll bury you. Oh. Get that. Why does it take me so long to get a damn pole out of her hands? She's got that kung fu grip or something. Oh. Up and over. Oh, you're dead, boy. Oh, you're lucky. There you go, it's finally stuck. It should be an easy battle now. I guess she still kind of has super boots. Oh, I don't know where she learned to fight, like, seriously. Get fucked. It's gonna be like, who do you save? Vicky Vale or Alfred? The building's crashing. All of a sudden, I'm gonna say fucking Alfred. Get the fuck out of here. Why would I say Vicky Vale? <laughs> Get fucked. Oh, you're lucky. It's a pretty sick fight scene, though. The choreography, that is. Damn, it's a lot of button presses. That's a KO punch if I've ever seen one. Yo, oh, yeah it is. <laughs> yes it is. <laughs> what? <laughs> Bitch, what are you made out of? God damn. Where did Alfred go? You belong in this place, Bruce. Lost. Gotten, buried in Gotham will not mourn. The sins of the Wayne bloodline end here. I don't know Batman ain't got no ch children running around. See you later. I'll see you later. <laughs> it's a sick weapon. Let's go, man. Got to put the cowl back on so I can see your face, Bruce. Take your sweet ass time, guys. It's not like a building's falling behind you. A week later. As to last week's events at Arkham Asylum, a spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. Miss Vale is missing and presumed dead following a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known only as the Batman. Her death marks the end of Children of Arkham's Reign of Terror. <sighs> if the public knew the half of it... It's better that they don't.
Just one echoey ass room, oh, man. Jeez. Uh, this came in the mail. It's unsigned. Selena. With everything that's been going on, I... I haven't gotten a chance to thank you for what you did. Sacrificing your identity for my safety. She dead. But uh, it was a dangerous thing to do. You could lose everything. The secrecy you've worked so hard to maintain. Gone. Vicky took my secret to the grave. But you couldn't have known that would happen. No. Yes, I could have. But what's done is done. That's pretty and obvious. your ear? At least there's something left of it. <laughs> Dr. Tompkins assured me it adds character. <laughs> that it does. Now my ear looks more like a bad we ear. We will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. You should be proud. Lady Arkham, Penguin, Harvey. They won't be the last to threaten Gotham. Likely not, but you'll be ready. In the meantime, let us hope for some peace. To peace. The damage done by the children of Arkham has left Gotham a city in turmoil. Faith in those at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent terror that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? It remains to be seen, but experts agree that... Gordon requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Leaders like you. Let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is, and let them know what you plan to do for his future. Well, this could be a fresh start. For you, and for this city. Though, in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne is Batman. Kind of fuck do you let him keep You've all his money? You've helped this city tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And that person, whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm proud of and honored to call my friend. I'm just doing my job. Nothing more. You're a better man than you'll admit. So, what do you intend to do about tonight? Well... Lucius has yet to invent a suit that'll let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. That is unfortunate. I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Bruce, you can help repair the damage done to your name, get the public support so that you can last, change things from the I'm top down. Last, uh, but Batman here. is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times, that is truly right. what Heads Gotham needs the most. For Batman, tales for Mr. Wayne. Perhaps one is truly the mask. Batman. Batman. One is who. <laughs> Batman will be in attendance. You'll make quite the impression. Gordon will be grateful. We are currently awaiting newly appointed acting police commissioner James Gordon, who will address the city for the first time in the wake of the terrorist attacks perpetrated by Lady Arkham. I, as acting police commissioner, Commissioner Gordon, that doesn't sound right. That sounds plenty right to me, man. Batman! Is everything all right? I assume you're not here to give a speech. So, what is it? It's an important day. Your first address to the city as acting commissioner. I wanted you to know that I stand with you. I want Gotham to know that there are those who will fight for them. Oh, I'm glad you feel that way. City's on edge. Tonight can make all the difference. You're one hell of an addition to this lineup. 
Gotham's best and brightest have turned out for this. I know you're not a man of many words, but I'd like to say something to Gotham on your behalf. Is there anything you'd like them to know? Maybe about how you'd like to be seen moving forward? Tell them I'll always be watching out for them. I'm sure they'll appreciate hearing that. You know, I always wanted this. To be commissioner someday. To have the chance to shape this... Already gone, sucker. Why can't I just be both? I, can I should probably show be used up to that now. now. As Bruce. <laughs> ECPD headquarters. You gonna speak? One of those citizens go. is Batman. He wanted me to tell you all that he'll be watching. Ensuring the safety of our good citizens. But one hero cannot change Gotham on his own. He needs all of you, too. Let Gotham be a city. Is that the heroes. Joker? United, strong, and hopeful. Totally the Joker. I saw red hair. Yeah, I'll save your bitch ass. Woo! That was close. Oh, just some fucking Mickey looking bitch. Hey girl. Clear the area. Get that bastard to lock up. That was random. Why would he do that? <laughs> just minutes ago, acting commissioner James Gordon delivered a rousing speech that turned into a shocking assassination attempt on his life. Batman made short work of the assassin. There's the Joker. Oh boy, it's gonna be tough to top that. But I'll give it a shot. Hee hee hee. Damn son. All right, so that was episode five, City of Light, the ends of a Batman Telltale series, or Batman and Telltale series, I should say. Let's see how everyone play this. Did you successfully distract Penguin? A bunch of people did. I wonder what happens if you don't. Hmm, interesting. Did you blame Alfred for his involvement? Yup, I did. Wow, only 2.3 of us did. That's surprising. Hmm. How did you respond to Selena? Everyone played it cool because they're smart. Did you take off the cowl? 73% did. Did you send Gorman's address as Bruce or Batman? Only 38% of us did as Bruce. Hmm. Or as Batman, I should say. Yeah, so anyways, that was uh, Batman and Telltale series. I thought it was uh, pretty damn fantastic. Cool story. A different story, for sure, that I've never seen in a Batman game or comic. Though I'm not a big comic reader, so I'm sure it's a, some sort of comic story. But I'll give it uh, the two thumbs up. Looking forward to more. Congrats again, Telltale Games, for making a great game. Uh, and as always, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream for uh, sticking with me for uh, almost three hours. I hope you enjoyed it. And for those of you watching YouTube, I hope you enjoyed the uh, Batman Telltale series. Until next time, guys, have yourselves a wonderful night or a wonderful day, depending on whenever you watch this. And uh, Hero Club for Life. Too sweet me.